A funny thing happens when you mix Mentos with Diet Coke. Believe it or not, here are 10 Coca-Cola hacks that actually work. Who knew that everyone's favorite soda was good for more than just quenching your thirst? So you're all making miracles. Clorox, Comet, or Coke? I know, Clorox. What makes a drink remarkable? Is it about great taste, or is it the ability to clean a toilet bowl? We're not saying that you should completely discount the taste, but that second point has to count for something, right? Add this to the list of things you would never try without us telling you to. Apparently, those ingredients that deliver the smooth and refreshing taste are also responsible for breaking down more of those common household grimes. It's true, all that's needed to clean your commode is a two liter of Coke. The superhero of drinks strikes again. I love winning! It's going to seem like an absolute crime against nature, but all you have to do is just pour the contents out into the toilet and let it soak. This should loosen up those unsightly stains and return the porcelain to its former glory. Put away those harsh chemicals that are bad for your health and the environment, and just use good old fashioned Coca-Cola the next time your bathroom is in need of a facelift. As an added bonus, Coke is great for cleaning the grout in between tile. Just use a similar method. Pour, soak, scrub, and watch your shower come back to life. It's alive! Gum be gone. Non-chemical gum removal achieved. Let's paint a picture. You're back in high school for the first day of class. Eager to get to algebra, you notice that the gum you thought you disposed of in the trash somehow ended up in your hair. What do you do? Cut it out with scissors? Go to the bathroom and try water? Or do you unceremoniously dip your hair into your friend's Coke? Sometimes the strangest option is truly the best, because in this case, gum stuck in hair can and has been remedied by the miraculous soda. Can you believe it? It's a miracle! The active ingredients work to weaken and break down the keratin in your hair. It also acts on the gum by dissolving the sticky ingredients and hardening the gum itself, allowing for a much easier removal process. Just a few minutes in Coca-Cola, and it doesn't matter how much big league chew you have stuck in your hair, it will come out. It might not be the prettiest sight, but let's be honest, if you have gum stuck in your hair, you're probably willing to do anything to get it out. Get out! The Coca-Cola Salon. A Coca-Cola Yankees party? Coca-Cola has been used in the back rooms of salons since the drink's invention. Somehow, people became aware of the fringe uses for Coke in the cosmetic industry, and it didn't take long for hairdressers to realize that when the soft drink was introduced to hair, it muted it. This means that Coke is and can be commonly used to darken highlights or mute overzealous coloring. Did your hairdresser get a little out of hand while coloring your hair? What's wrong with you? What are you looking at? Well, don't worry. You can mute that platinum blonde with a little soda in the shower. In all seriousness, Coke is still used in some professional settings, and certain clients swear by its ability to give hair a certain tone. While a treatment like this sounds ridiculous and sticky, there is some validity that Coca-Cola makes for a good hair treatment. You'll just have to ask your stylist the next time you see them. New to Babbletop? Then how about hitting that subscribe button? Everyone's doing it, so don't be left behind. Thanks. Yeah, baby, yeah! Shine that quarter with a Coke. Shiny. I shiny. Greasy, grimy, and just plain filthy coins. It's money, but it's also, well, kinda gross. We all still come across coins from time to time, and depending on their condition, sometimes we leave them in their place rather than add them to the piggy bank. Instead of discarding or passing up literal pocket change, why not try taking the worst offenders and soaking them in the mystery elixir that is Coca-Cola? Elixir of the gods. Going back to the drink's acidic nature, it works wonders at dissolving the film off of coins. Want to see what Abraham Lincoln looked like back in the day? Well, just give him a couple days in a Coca-Cola jacuzzi and he'll be right as rain. How much change have you saved up recently? A can's worth? A bottle? A 24-pack? Coke is not only responsible for quenching our thirst, but it also brings our past presidents to their former glory. Making stains or taking stains? It's all right, Diet Cola doesn't stain. It's not diet. 
We've put Coca-Cola on just about everything else around the house. Why should your clothing be any different? It might seem counterintuitive to put a sticky solution on your clothes after they experience daily punishment, but when it comes to removing common stains from clothing, Coke has actually been shown to remove things such as blood, dirt, oil, and other pervasive mixtures. No need to be worried about the soft drink itself causing a stain. If used in conjunction with a wash, the Coke won't have time to set and will simply be lifting that pesky stain. It's a win-win. If you're scared to break out the bleach or don't know which of the 2,000 stain removers to turn to, simply grab a can of Coke from the fridge and take care of business in a just-as-effective, albeit strange, way. This isn't exactly a revelation, as people have been using carbonated beverages to get stains out of clothing for many years. But now you finally know what people are talking about when they ask for soda water to remove a stain. Rest assured that the tradition remains alive today, and in all honesty, any car carbonated beverage would probably work, but our money is still on Coca-Cola. You better believe it, big balls. Shake off the rust with a Coke. Rust to rust, amen. It seems there's no end to the things that Coke can clean. This next fix is going to be for anyone who's noticed the undercarriage of their car getting a tad orange. Coke has a myriad of ingredients, and phosphoric acid is prevalent, and it also happens to be great at treating oxidized metal. When introduced to rust, this phosphoric acid eats away at the corrosion, which causes unsightly damage to your car. It's uh, all rusted out, so rusted. Coke isn't just great for removing rust, but it can also be used to remove troublesome road salt and other impurities that may cause further damage to your undercarriage or paint. Simply pour the Coke on the problem area, let it soak while you scrub, removing the affected rust. When you're finished, just wash away the sugary mixture and voila! The family ride will be sparkling just like it once did. You won't find Coca-Cola lining the shelves of any professional detail shops, but if you're in a pinch and need to spruce up your set of wheels, Coke might just be the soft drink to turn to in your time of need. Soothes insect bites. I think I might be pregnant, not bitten by a radioactive spider. Besides being a beloved beverage the world over, Coca Cola can also be used in some unconventional uses when it comes to the human body. We're talking about bug bites, people. Yes, it's true. This miracle mixture can be poured directly onto bee stings and jellyfish stings alike. We're trying to get jellyfish to sting us to prove we can't get hurt. Dabbing a little bit on mosquito bites is said to work to relieve the itch and swelling. If camping has been especially Especially rough and the gang's all out of bug spray, turn to everyone's favorite soft drink for another unexpected remedy. Just make sure to use it conservatively. Being sticky with coke all over you in the middle of nowhere doesn't exactly sound like the best camping trip. A Coca-Cola marinade. Ketchup, Coca-Cola, and fricassee possum. Yeah. As far as wacky uses for Coke go, this is not exactly one of them. It's instead more practical. Let's not forget where the drink got its start, and that was a drink. We doubt the inventor ever foresaw the massive impact his drink would have on the world, but one thing he did know was that it tasted great. It was a natural extension to suggest its use in the culinary world. For over a hundred years, chefs the world over have had the opportunity to work with the flavor of Coca-Cola and some truly massive magical creations have come about as a result. One of these delicious applications is to use the soft drink as a marinade for any piece of meat that's going to be introduced to open flame. This is particularly popular in grilling and barbecue. I'm a freaking rock star, man! The Coca-Cola not only works to impart its one-of-a-kind flavor, but it also tenderizes the meat to melt in your mouth perfection. When this sugary marinade is introduced to high heat, it will caramelize and create that delicious and savory bark that barbecue fans clamor over. If you're planning on using Coke in your own cooking, make sure to let the marinade sit for a good long time before cooking. When preparing, make sure not to cook the meat too high too fast, as the sugars can burn easily. If some of the best chefs in the world keep Coke in their kitchen, the brand must be doing something right. Next time you're looking to spice up the family barbecue, since you already have it in the fridge, why not try a marinade made from Coca-Cola? With this newfound knowledge, you might find that it's your new summer barbecue go-to. It's a pesticide. Oh no, these are pesticide-free. I ate one of these for breakfast this morning and I found a worm in it. 
While we wouldn't suggest you start pouring your Coca-Cola onto the houseplants, it is true that certain ingredients have luck with repelling bugs from your garden. Farmers in India have been using the soft drink as a staple for many years now. They say that it's excellent for getting rid of slugs and snails, and can be even used to attract ants if farmers suspect that their crops are infested. They simply spread the fabled soft drink, wait for the ants, and in turn, the ants devour the larvae of whatever common pest has taken up residence among the crops. The CSE, the Center for Science and Environment, actually did studies and concluded that trace amounts of pesticide residue were found in Coca-Cola. It's confirmed. Before you go running to pull the Coke out of your fridge to throw away, it's yet unconfirmed whether this was the result of the local water source used in creating that supply of Coke. Could this be the explanation as to why farmers in India are having so much luck? I guess we'll never know, but we're chalking this victory up to Coca-Cola. If you're looking to find finally go organic or are just tired of paying for the countless insect repellents, a spray bottle of Coke could go a long way. In the same avenue, Coke is great for composting. Just form a routine where you consistently spray your compost with Coke and the sugar will cause your compost to decompose much faster. It would seem that Coca-Cola really is a farmer's best friend. You're my special friend. Corroded car battery? Coke to the rescue. Diet Coke, please. For those of you who are mechanically inclined, this next fix might just make Coca-Cola your new favorite drink. If you know anything about car batteries, you know it's an essential part of what makes the car go. There are any number of complications that can arise with a car's battery, and oftentimes it's a simple fix. Pesky corrosion is known to build up on the battery's terminals, and this can cause shorts in the electrical supply, which means no power for your car. In this hack, Coca-Cola can be applied to this corrosion that builds Build up on your battery. As a side note, please be extremely careful when working under the hood of your car. In this particular case, make sure your battery is unpowered and unplugged. Gloves and eye protection are also recommended. I'm protected, man. I've got protection. Just apply a little of the soft drink to any areas that you spot corrosion, trying to get it directly on as best you can. Then the next step is to let it sit. While the Coca-Cola does its job, a wire brush is going to be your best friend to remove the residue. Scrub until you don't see any more of this corrosion along the battery's terminals and cables and rinse the mixture off with water. If this buildup was plaguing your car and you've done your job, the battery should have a clean connection. That means you won't be waiting around in the snow the next time your car decides to die. Who knew Coca-Cola had such a litany of uses in the real world? Amazing! Stay right here and tap or click another great video. Hit that subscribe button and ring that bell to join our notification squad.